If you rush to say one, slow down. There's a sneaky detail everyone overlooks. All right, let's talk about this expression. 10 divided by 10 divided by 10 divided by 10. And honestly, I get why most people jump straight to that quick little trick. You see the first pair, 10 divided by 10, and your brain goes, okay, that's one. Then you look at the last pair, another 10 divided by 10, and you go, that's also one. And then you finish it off with one divided by one equals one. It feels smart, it feels efficient, but uh, it's absolutely not how this expression works. This is exactly the trap the problem is designed to create. Your brain tries to group the numbers however it wants, but division does not let you rearrange things like that. You can't just pair up left and right however you feel like. That's the mistake almost everyone makes. And hey, before we break down the real logic, if you like catching these math traps and understanding what's actually going on, maybe hit the like button and subscribe. It really helps, and it keeps these mini lessons coming your way. All right, back to the fun part. So here's the key idea. PEMDAS. Parentheses, exponents, multiplication and division, addition and subtraction. But the important detail is multiplication and division share the same priority. And when they appear in a row like this, you must go left to right, no jumping around. So let's do this properly. Start with the original expression. 10 divided by 10 divided by 10 divided by 10. Step one, go left to right. 10 divided by 10 equals one. So now we have one divided by 10 divided by 10. Next, one divided by 10 equals 0 0.1. Now the last step, 0 0.1 divided by 10 equals 0 0.01. And that's it. No shortcuts, no pairing, no clever cancellations, just pure left to right division. So, said clearly and with emphasis, the correct answer is 0 0.01, not 1. And now, got a different take? Drop your thoughts in the comments. I'd love to hear your logic.